Question for you. Do you ever experience this while you're editing? Maybe you're working on something for a client and you, and you, and you just, I think we've all been there. We can all relate to this. So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about how to supercharge your computer so that you can have pretty seamless playback and editing workflow. We'll be covering the gear that you need in your computer, the benefits of having said gear, a bit of an overview of hard drives and the different hard drives that exist, as well as file structure and a bit of a performance test so you can see some comparisons. So like every other YouTube in the tech world, let's jump into that intro. the first to admit it was only a few months ago that I started educating myself on the types of hard drives to use. I didn't know there were other ways and people would always be like, SSDs, and I'd be like, I don't know what that is, and be like, use SSDs. I started to listen to that, and then I started to deep dive, and then I bought all the right gear, and lo and behold, I now have a type of workflow that works for me. Now, this week's episode is brought to you by Samsung. The product that we'll be talking about in this video specifically was something that I put into my desktop PC that I built six months ago when I wanted to upgrade the Samsung NVMe 970 Evo Plus. This is an amazing SSD and it's done wonders for me in terms of my workflow. I'm gonna put a little asterisk because this is an essential part of getting good performance, but make sure that your motherboard is compatible with this specific SSD. All right, so that is the product from Samsung, but let's do a bit of an overview so that you have a better understanding of these different types of hard drives and how they work. All right, let's take this cup of coffee right here. This, we'll call this the HDD. Now you're probably familiar with an HDD, this is a spinning disc. They're very easily accessible. A lot of people go and buy them because they're cheap and you're probably using one right now. Now let's say you want to level up, you want some better performance, so you go and buy an SSD. This is an espresso. You take the espresso, you're like, woo, this is a nice little performance kick I'm getting here. I might switch to espresso. But did you know that there's one more level beyond that? So let's take this double shot of espresso, let's pour some Red Bull into it, and also a five hour energy drink. That right there, that is the 970 Evo Plus. This thing is a rock star. Do not make this drink. If you make this drink and then you actually consume it, it I don't know, it could kill you, it could just cause you to, like, it's too much, do not drink that. So what are the benefits of having the 970 Evo Plus in your computer? Well, number one, smoother playback, you're not gonna have any of this glitchy stuff. Number two, faster rendering and exports. Now, if you're like me, sometimes you have some very heavy After Effects work. It takes a long time to export. You don't wanna just sit there. You wanna like get back to work. Number three, it takes up way less space in your computer. The thing is literally like this big. Number four, reliability and endurance. Now, an HDD has a spinning disk in it. There's moving parts there, which ultimately means that there's a higher chance of losing your files. So let's say you've gone out and you've done a big photo shoot. You have like 100 gigs that you need to dump onto your card. Well, that transfer from your SD card to that SSD is so fast. And the last thing is that this thing is super easy to install. Here's a clip for when I built my computer. My friend Ross here is just installing it right into the motherboard. Okay, great. So now you understand what gear you should have and how that gear essentially works but it's rendered useless unless you actually set it up properly. So I'm gonna tell you how my structure is on my current desktop PC. Let's start with the different types of hard drives that I have in my current computer. The first one is the 970 Evo Plus. This is where I run all my programs and my operating system off of. The second 970 Evo Plus that I have in my computer, this SSD, this is where I store all my current projects that I'm editing. This video that we're currently editing right now is on this SSD drive. And my last hard drive is an HDD, and I call this one The Vault. This is where I just store projects that are completed that I might wanna access later on. All right, we're gonna do a comparison test specifically between an HDD and the 970 Evo Plus SSD and compare when the files are living on the HDD as well as when the files are living on the SSD. So as you can see, there's a pretty huge difference in performance between the two types of hard drives out there. I used to just accept if that's the performance I was getting, I was like, oh, that's just the way it is and I'll have to live with it. 
Turns out there are better options. Genuinely speaking, I was pretty stoked when Samsung reached out about this product because I was like, oh, this one's already in my computer. I'm currently using this one. I've also lived with that performance for the last six months and it's really benefited my workflow. I can actually make better quality videos. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but the channel's gone from like just making 1080p videos to 4K video uploads in the last little while. That's because of using products like this. So thank you, Samsung, for sponsoring this video and making dope products like this so that us as creators, you and me, can just get back to creating because that's really all we want to do is create more and have better performance. All right, guys, that's the end of this video. Hopefully this is beneficial to you. You've learned a little something. And if you have, please like this video, subscribe if you want to catch more videos like this and keep learning and hit the bell to be notified for future ones. If you guys want to go check out any of the products that we talked about in this video, links are below. And again, thank you, Samsung, for sponsoring this one. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. Should I try a sip of that drink? No, no, I really shouldn't. Not at all. That, that, that would definitely hurt me. When you live by trains, you don't want to make videos, but you still do. Today, guys, I don't know why I'm doing a finger. <laughs>